probably got a brand new shiny electronic gadget for Christmas and you want to get rid of your old one, say you want to dump your old phone, well, word of the wise, you need to be very careful what you do with it. There may be some information stored on your phone or your tablet or your computer that you don't realize has not been wiped clean. It throws up a red flag. Bobby Kuzma, founder of Effortless IT, says the problem is expansive. It, it's a huge issue. People who sell their old phones and tablets and computers may have no idea they are risking tons of personal information to make a few extra dollars. Most of the phones on the secondary market still have original data from the first owner on them whether it's on the SIM card or on the memory of the phone itself. Things you never really want to get out. You Your call history, frequently called contacts. In the case of smartphones, it can have passwords saved for your Facebook account, for your online banking, your email, your it's secret scary. diary. It's best to make sure you encrypt your phone, which doesn't hide the files, but it makes the contents unreadable. iPhones, he says, are self-encrypting. Android phones are not. And it's not just phones. Those handy-dandy portable flash drives may be your worst enemy. Once data's been written to them, there's no way to reliably ensure that it's all been overwritten because of how the chip technology works. So then how do you get rid of it? Really? That's the best way to do it? That's the best way. Physically destroy the media. Okay. And we have some help with protecting your phone and protecting your other information. Just log on to WFLA.com under links mentioned.